some more girl power coming to season two of Harley Quinn. Let's take a couple minutes to break down the new characters that are set to appear next year. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Comic Book Nostalgia, and got a little story for you on the Harley Quinn TV series. But before we get started, make sure you get in on this month's giveaway. We're giving away a copy of Secret Wars. In order to get in on the giveaway, all you have to do is be a subscriber, hit like, and leave a comment. Hey guys, as you know, we're pretty big fans of the Harley Quinn TV series over on DC Universe. I'm actually working on this week's review right now. But a story dropped this morning from our friends over at Geeks Worldwide, and it breaks down a couple of new characters that will appear in the second season of Harley Quinn. The first character is a character known as Dr. Trap, once known as Larry Trap. He's a guy who lost his girlfriend, Caroline Anders, who was caught in the crossfire between the Justice Experience and the House of Pain. He blamed everybody for her death and swore revenge on them all. He later went on about trapping and killing various members of both teams. He is a rather wacky looking character, has a giant cybernetic jaw, and should fit in perfectly with the gory setting of the show. He more than a little bit actually reminds me of Trap Jaw from back in the Masters of the Universe He-Man days. The other two characters are a little more interesting. The first one is the one and only Selena Kyle, aka Catwoman. Selena Kyle is one of the most iconic and beloved characters in all of the DC comics, and it's not because she's a hero, it's more because she has that self-motivation that everybody can identify with. She's all about doing her own thing and will have a good time at it. Now the report says she's going to be voiced by Santa Lathan, who also did The Affair and The Twilight Zone. What's most interesting to me about Selena Kyle joining the show is now we have all three members of Gotham City Sirens. Makes you kind of wonder if one of the plot lines next year will see Harley and Ivy team up with Catwoman to do some other jobs minus her regular crew. The other big character coming to next season is Barbara Gordon, aka Batgirl. Now most people are pretty familiar with Batgirl, and when they say Batgirl here, I think they mean actually Batgirl and not Oracle. This does beg a question, does this mean we're going to get the Birds of Prey, since Batgirl is actually a founding member? Now that I think about it, I really wonder if we're going to get a Birds of Prey vs Gotham City Sirens type episode next year. Would make a lot of sense, and you know, team ups are in. Also it makes me wonder if we get some other new characters like the Huntress or the Black Canary. Now if you didn't know, Barbara Gordon is more than just a bat dress vigilante, she's also a genius level hacker, information broker, and expert martial artist. Now obviously these are not the only characters that are going to join the next season of Harley Quinn. I'm sure we're going to get many more. The first episode dropped back in November, and since we don't have very many season 2 shows from DC Universe, we just have Titan season 2 as a standard which dropped about a year later after the first season. So hopefully we can expect season 2 of Harley Quinn sometime next November, or maybe a little sooner. I'm pretty sure Harley Quinn is going to continue to grow its own very unique version of the DC Universe. It's bloody, it's adult, they use giant f-bombs and c-words to kind of dictate how characters are received by other characters, Dr. Psycho, and it's something unlike anything else that anybody really is putting out right now. I can't wait to see what they do with these new characters. So what do you guys think? Are you excited to see Catwoman and Barbara Gordon join the show? And what do you think about Dr. Trap? Weird, huh? Sign off in the comments below. If you like this video, make sure you press like, click subscribe, and if you don't ring that bell, you won't get any updates. Peace.